The Gospel for this feast of St. Anthony of Padua is taken from Matthew 5th chapter 13 to the 16th verse. Jesus said to his disciples, You are the salt of the earth. But if salt loses its taste, with what can it be seasoned? It is no longer good for anything but to be thrown out and trampled underfoot. You are the light of the world. A city set on a mountain cannot be hidden, nor do they light a lamp and then put it under a bushel basket. It is set on a lampstand, where it gives light to all in the house. Just so, your light must shine before others, that they may see your good deeds and glorify your Heavenly Father. Jesus is saying two things. He's telling his disciples that he has created, by his presence in them, a force. It's a force that saves, makes life better, enlightens people. These are images of salt and light. And you never check salt to see if it's fresh enough. And you once you light a light, it's hard to hide it if you if it's there. So what he's saying is, just as these things are always what they are intended to be, so will you be in the work of the kingdom. Don't try to make yourself salt and light. You are. You are already gifted with these gifts.
Closing prayer. Father, we turn to you always for wisdom, and we work hard to please you and to make ourselves better, but we have to understand that when we are authentically living in you and working with you, we are effective. Don't ever let us doubt it. Let us trust in your promises that cannot be taken. And we ask this in Jesus' name. Amen.